What is going on everyone? It's Manny from Backcourt Violation. Got another video and we got some breaking news. The Milwaukee Bucks have just hired former Atlanta Hawks coach Mike Budenholzer as their next coach. And I think it's a good fit. Um, Budenholzer is a good coach. You know, uh, obviously Atlanta didn't have a great season this year, but they had like no talent outside of Schroeder and Josh Collins. Um... But we saw what he was, what he's able to do with decent talent. You know, I think he's going into a job where he's got more talent than he ever had in Atlanta. You know, he yeah, he had Horford and Teague and Johnson and uh, you know Demar Carroll. But I think Demar Carroll was a product of the system, more or less. He had Paul Millsap as well. But I mean, you know, he's walking into Milwaukee with the Greek Freak, um, Chris Middleton. You know, I. I think they got a good shot at retaining Jabari Parker back. They've got Malcolm Brogdon. You know, T Tony Snell's not bad. You know, so the, the and more. The list goes on. You know, the Thon Maker. You know, so they've got they've got these young guys that they can build around. Plus, they got a draft pick this year, obviously. So, you know, uh, I, I like it a lot. That being said, I'm still confused as to why Jason Kidd was fired. Um, I thought, you know, he, I know he had a close relationship with the players. They loved playing for him. Um, so that I didn't really get. You know, that was probably like he maybe wanted more control and management, you know, in, in front office decisions. But still, though, you know, he was respected. But th this isn't, you know, I mean, it, it is an upgrade at coach. But I think the culture fit was probably better with Jason Kidd. But I like the hire. Um I think it's going to help them actually in the playoffs. Truthfully, you know, Budenholzer has made the Western, the Eastern Conference Finals with the Hawks once. So, you know, all in all, good hire. Um, and that's it. Have a good one, guys. Stay tuned.